Well, we're in my backyard today. I have this big metal gazebo here with nothing under it, so I thought it'd be a good video to make a picnic table. So I built this little jig here to make the legs in and the cross piece, and then I'll build the top up on there because this ground's not too flat to work on. So I just went to Home Depot, got 13 2x6 studs and three 2x4 studs. And then all I'm gonna need is my saw, my gun, a hammer, a square, a tape, and a pencil. So start by making the legs. The legs are gonna be 33 inches long to short of 30 degree angles. So I'll mark my 33. Two of them. I'm gonna need 30 degrees. So 30, 30. And that's long to short. So 30 again over here, 30 again here. So there's two legs, now I'll get two more. I'll use the same angle, 33 inches, long to short. 33, 33. Same 30 degree angle, 30 degree. There's my legs, those are scraps. Now I'll cut my two cross pieces. I'll do the same 30 degree angle on two of them. And then I'll go five feet long to long on this one. Five feet. Five feet. 30 degrees. I went like this, but you could also do it from the top. 30 degrees. Oh, no, that needs to go to the tongue, so 30 degrees. I'll take these to our jig. Fit in here like this. You want to see the video of how I built this jig? Leave me a comment. Sit like that. Now I can just measure up off the bottom. So one foot four and a half. One foot four and a half. So I can take my cross piece. Down here, that'll be to the top of it. Make sure I'm the same distance here, I'm 14 and 3 quarters, 12 and 3 quarters, so we'll try 13 and 3 quarters, 13 and 3 quarters, so we'll get there. Make sure we're good, tight everywhere, on the line. I'm gonna put the top piece on it. So the top pieces are gonna be two by four, and they're gonna be two foot four and a half. And that's long to long, same 30 degrees. So we'll go 30 degrees. 30 degrees. We're gonna need three of these pieces. Got three of these. I'm gonna use one for the top here, but I want to put another one on flat so that I can nail the top through the bottom here. But I can't put it on with the angle like that. I gotta have the angle going the other way with a bevel. So a bunch of these pieces. I'll put a 30 degree bevel on my saw and cut the end square and then go the same two foot four and a half long to long so this will be square but that's the long of the bevel so, so long to long two foot four and a half should be the same as this so let me nail these two together Put 
this on here. This is my center line. I'll mark it here too. I'll find the center of this. It's two foot four and a half, so it would be one foot two and a quarter. This is the center. I'll line that up with that. That aside, make another one. Now, for my top piece, I'll make another one of those. Put four and a half, long to long. There's two legs. Make a top. And pick the nicer side of the board. Actually, I'm gonna put the nice side down because this will be the top of the table. I need five of them. here and I'll bring this out because I'm going to space these a little bit with all my six inch bars Same thing over here. cross piece in here. I'll put my last one of these on. Center piece. I'll go about two foot ten long to short. See how this fits. Go to there. That works good. So it would work over here, but. 
it would be an inch and a half short because this is on the this side of the center line so I'll just put another two by four in here rip it down the inch and a half so I'll trace another one of these footmark now we just need some seats was hanging over past here 11 inches so, so 11 inches here this about a quarter inch flush it up here squeeze this a quarter inch Get this seven feet Same 11 inches. That's how you build a picnic table, with just a saw and a nail gun. Now it's time for a beer.